U.S. Air Force build B-21 radar preparing for test flight. The Air Force is now building its first test aircraft of the new B-21 radar stealth bomber, aircraft engineered to elude the most advanced air defenses over enemy territory without being seen. We're closely monitoring the build of the additional test aircraft and associated software to support the first flight, Air Force Chief of Staff General David Goldfin told an audience at an event hosted by the Mitchell Institute for Aerospace Studies. As for the timing of the first flight and many of the acquisition specifics, they are not available simply because the program is largely secret. Although few details are known, engineers, observers, program managers and Air Force flag officers are all very clear this new bomber will introduce stealth technology the likes of which the world has never seen before. Advances in computer processing, digital networking technology and targeting systems now enable some air defenses to detect even stealth aircraft with much greater effectiveness. However, the B-21, is being engineered with this specific challenge in mind to ensure a new generation of stealth will be able to penetrate air defenses for decades into the future. Russian-built S-400 and S-500 air defense weapons are able to use digital technology to network nodes to one another to pass tracking and targeting data across wide swaths of terrain. New air defenses also use advanced command and control technology to detect aircraft across a much wider spectrum of frequencies than previous systems could. It by no means indicates these current and future air defense will in any way threaten the B-21. All of these emerging technical factors continue to inform a growing consensus regarding future threats. But the B-21 appears to quite possibly be the only platform that will be able to penetrate certain enemy weapons and advanced air defenses for decades to come. Much of the construction and prototyping likely involves subsystems, avionics and weapons integration, test aircraft manufacturing, building a stealth aircraft requires a deliberate, methodical process of engineering contours from the beginning. As engineers describe it, stealth has to be built into the design from inception. Every bolt, seam, curve, wing and weapon needs to be built within specific parameters so as to ensure the lowest possible radar signature. Stealth aircraft have a notable absence of sharp edges, protruding structures and other items potentially more visible to enemy radar. Weapons are carried internally. Antennas and sensors are often built into parts of the fuselage itself so as to minimize detectable shapes on the aircraft. In effect, the B-21 mission will be to fly into heavily defended enemy airspace, detect and destroy targets and leave without an enemy ever knowing they were there. Also, stealth aircraft such as the B-2 and B-21 bomber are built with an internal, or buried, engine to decrease the heat signature and various methods of controlling exhaust. Finally, the success of stealth relies upon a particular blend of materials used as coating for the exterior. These materials, the components of which are not publicly available, are described as radar absorbent meaning a radar's electronic signal simply may not bounce off or return with an accurate picture. Some have said that properly completed stealth construction can make a stealth airplane appear like a bird or an insect to enemy radar. Part of this consensus, according to senior Air Force weapons developers, is implicitly built upon the fact that the B-21 is being engineered to be perpetually upgradable. Among other things, this means that new software, sensors, weapons, Computers and avionics can quickly emerge as they become available. While naturally sparing with details, Air Force senior leaders have said the new B-21 will be able to hold any target at risk, anywhere in the world, at any time. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe.